So usually what we like to do is a few days before we leave town, uh, we like to go check as much things as possible. And at the same time, we're driving around town, getting the feel, getting comfortable, making sure we don't hear any noises or anything before we head out of town. So on this day, that's what we're doing. Just driving around. We spent four hours driving around and at the same time getting a few things done like uh, tightening the nuts on the wheels getting dinner uh, fueling up emptying the gray tank and stuff like that just double checking things checking for leaks and stuff like that before driving out of town just a little quick start getting some chip up play look at the kids <laughs> so I'm sitting in the passenger side just looking at the instrument panel on this old MCI Tomorrow, sorry, tomorrow we're going to do some washing, it's dirty right now, the windows are all dirty, but we're out in town, Chipotle, Wait, why is it zoomed in? So, as you can see in the reflection, another Bucky stop for ICs. And uh, we just showed Alvaro how to open the door. And looks like he remembered. He remembers anyways I think it's time to go home now it's getting late Wait. what Wait. what I have a, bump. a bump okay I'll check it out here, here go to the back all right let's go let's go we just checked out the we torqued the wheels out and uh, I sprayed a little bit of cleaner. That's why you see the drips there. But I'm going to clean it up because you're not supposed to see the drips. That's a bad sign. But in this case, I know why the drips are there. Uh, we went to go retorque everything. That one in the front has the most drips because I think I overdid it with the rust preventer. But I think the other one's okay. Yeah, see how this one I didn't use much and it's clean. All right, time to go home. Here, shifting. So I just release the brakes and then I have to do the service brake, a full application. And now it's the brakes, the park brakes are literally gone. Just by hitting the switch, it doesn't do it. And then full automatic. And we're off. We scared us over the tongues. We're almost home, so it's gonna be like a five minute drive. Minute drives to the hands of the smoothest. Because you're just happy to be home. We've been on the bus. What time did we get on? Does anybody remember? It was like, it was like 7 45, so close to 8. About four hours? 
Yeah. We've been on the bus tonight? No, about three. Is this yeah. 11? It's already 11? Plus, the engine was warming up for 30 minutes at home. So, it's been doing about three to four hours tonight. On stop. And Tom, Tom was by quick. Yeah. Matter of fact, the sun was going down when we first started going. Or leaving the house. We went out to eat. We cooked some dinner. We went to the shop to torque all the wheels, which is two different towns, Lake Town and Crosby. And uh, back to Bucky's, because we, we were here earlier, but we forgot to get our ice. So before we head home, we have to come get our ice. And of course, the kids love it. And I love this more than the kids. So like I said, we're almost home. We gotta stop here at Garth Road. Uh, and then we're gonna drive into the country, which there's nothing over there, it's just all dark. So we won't record that far. But just a quick drive. I know some people have been wanting to do a full drive, which we're going to do probably tomorrow. Uh, I'm going to have someone else drive the bus and I'm going to be outside in my car following the bus. And a camera in here. But that's for later. Right now we're just doing a little sneak. What is it called? Sneak peek? Sneak peek. I'm like smoking this car next to me. I think I'll look for it. Yeah. <laughs> the car's probably thinking. He was covered in smoke. Oh. It's uh, yeah. <laughs> I feel bad. <laughs> I forget that when I give it gas, it's a lot of exhaust coming out. So now when you're done filling them ice cream, give me a spoon because I need it. The ice cream? Oh, you have to go? I thought it was more calm. <laughs> yeah, his character is a little bit like Ralito. Mm. But Jacob is way Stream. more active. <laughs> way more. Like double. Maybe triple. <laughs> Alright, so this is as far as we're going to record for tonight. But one thing we learned today is that the, the knots on the wheels for the left hand side of the driver are left hand thread and the ones on my right all on that side are right hand thread we almost made a mistake we started doing right hand over here on the left yeah. and the knots started coming off and then i remember from uh lacrosse cruiser he has a video showing that the left side of the bus is left hand thread and the right hand side of the bus is right hand threads. And we yeah, tore down that. to 450. We went with 450. 450 ah, was the max. Foot pound. Would, yeah, foot pounds, yeah. 450 foot pound is what we did on all of them. And everything was good. Except that one that we accidentally loosened, we had to re tighten. But um, that's it. We're going to make a turn here and then that's it. Thank you for watching and um, keep coming back. Subscribe so we can take this bus to California. And of course, 
made the left from the farthest turning lane. I know somebody got mad because they claim I made a turn from the inside lane. Mm -hmm. I don't remember that, but somebody claims I did that on one of the videos. I don't know. Thank you. Bye-bye.